Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. I am Sini from the House of Purple Berries. Today being Children's Day, I have something really special, simple and delicious for my young friends. Eggless chocolate cupcake. So let's start baking. So let's begin with our eggless series. You can note the ingredients. It is very important to have the correct measurements for baking. So, baking se pehle sari cheezo ko maine ready rakha hai yahan pe. The first step is to sieve all the dry ingredients except the sugar. So, I'm starting with the all-purpose flour or the maida. I'm also preheating my oven at 180 degree. It is very important to preheat the oven before baking and preheat it at the same temperature as instructed in the recipe. It's a lot of maida, so I will sieve a little bit of maida. After that, I will add the other ingredients. Okay, and now let me add the baking powder. In goes the baking soda. Salt, as per the measurement. And the cocoa powder. Okay, I'm gonna save this all again. As a channe say, we're making sure that all ingredients are mixed well and uh, it is properly aerated. Okay, so I'm done. Let me quickly. Okay, it's done. So now let me quickly give it a quick stir. That's my spatula. Yeah, here we go. Right. So I have all my dry ingredients except the sugar. Let me keep it aside. Let me mix the wet ingredients now. I have my buttermilk too and I add my brown sugar. Just make sure that the brown sugar mixes well with buttermilk. I will mix it so that there are no lumps. And sugar will be mixed Okay, that's a very good mixture. Now I am going to add I just want to make sure that I add oil very slowly in a steady stream of oil. Uh, you know, it is a steady stream of oil. So I will just add that slowly and mix it. Yeah. I'm just making sure that my sugar also dissolves, the brown sugar. Right. And it emulsifies really good. Okay, I'm done with it. Let me just mix it again. Right, so my wet ingredients are also ready. Let me get my dry ingredients. Now I'm going to pour my wet ingredients into my dry ingredients. Don't do the other way. Always try to put the wet ingredients in the dry ingredients. Okay, I'm doing it very slowly so that there are no lumps formed. So at times, this batter may become really thick. That actually depends on the sugar and the maida and the cocoa powder. Okay, sometimes it may just stay uh, uh, loose and uh, in a pouring consistency and sometimes it becomes dark, uh, I'm sorry, thick. So here it is little thick. If you can see this, my, even my batter is little thick. It is not into a pouring consistency, though there are no lumps to it. So now I'm going to add two to three tablespoon of milk, warm milk and uh, it shouldn't be hot it shouldn't be very co cold you can add warm milk and you can see that the consistency is good enough here all right i'm just mixing it well and i am ready to pour them in my muffin liners here we go just fill three fourths of the muffin liner and we're good to go here now my oven is ready for the cupcakes. I'm going to bake them at 180 degree for uh, close to 25 to 30 minutes. It depends from oven to oven. So you can put it at 25 minutes and uh, check. 
so uh, once we get the aroma of the cupcake you can just insert the toothpick or a knife and check if it comes out clean that means our cupcakes are ready so friends bake these yummy delicious chocolate cupcakes and i'll see you next time keep baking